Five o'clock. Time and a half for the weather magician with PJ Wiggins the evening report. Thursday, September 5th, 2013. Good evening, everybody. Current conditions at five o'clock in North Massachusetts, 67 degrees the temperature with a few clouds with a humidity of 71%, wind speed variable 5 miles per hour, barometer 30 inches, 2.57 degrees, and a visibility of 10 miles. All right, let's take a look at our little radar scope and it shows a couple of fat little rain showers. We'll zoom it in and it shows a little rain showers around the Hingham area and around the Coatsen and situate areas. Stretch it out down in the Norwell and Brooklyn and down in Whitman and stretch out in the Weymouth. And a few blobs of rain showers around the southeastern corner of the Massachusetts, and a few couple of little rain showers in the north of Lowell near Tingsburg, and a couple of batches of rain showers around Lowell, and a few batches of rain showers in the Interstate 95 quarter from Denver all the way out up to Newberry and in the Newberry Port. And a couple of lines of rain and showers off the Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts coastline and stretching out in the Falmouth. And a batch of rain showers off the Long Island and the New Jersey coastline there. And a couple of lines of rain showers off the Prince Edward Island stretching in the central part of Nova Scotia and off the western Nova Scotia coastline. And another batch of rain showers in northern Maine, down in the northern New Brunswick and the northeastern Quebec and northern Quebec. And then our batches of rain showers in northeast New Mexico stretching, covering the scent of all the Lone Star State of Texas. There are popcorn clusters of showers and storms. And a couple of lines of rain showers in southern South Dakota down in the eastern New Mexico with a couple of little batches of thunderstorms. And then our popcorn clusters of showers and storms in northwestern Arizona down in the Utah down in Colorado. And a few popcorn clusters of showers and storms in central Nevada down for seven Idaho down for seven and and around Oregon, and a couple of line of rain showers and storms around West Montana, down in Northern Idaho, and Eastern Washington. And a couple of batches of rain showers in southwestern British Columbia, and southern British Columbia, and southeastern British Columbia, and a few batches of rain showers in north central Saskatchewan. Turning off the radar, turn on the satellite loop, and it shows a line of clouds covering eastern Canada. And covering in this, uh, New England, and then out in New York City and New Jersey. And then a line of clouds covering the Carolinas, stretching the eastern Kentucky, Tennessee, down in Georgia, down in north central Florida. And a batches of clouds covering Mexico and around the Gulf of Mexico. And another batches of clouds stretching around to western Kentucky, down from Missouri, down from Iowa, down to northern Kansas, down in eastern Nebraska, down in South Dakota. And a pop blob of Clouds around eastern North Dakota and down in western Minnesota. And a batch of clouds down in northern Colorado, down through Wyoming and Idaho, down in Montana, down for Washington, Oregon, down in southern Alberta, down in southern British Columbia, and stretching British Columbia, down in Alaska. And another batch of clouds down in central Saskatchewan, down in eastern to north central Alberta, another batch of clouds covering Hudson Bay and northern Canada. Okay, let us take a look at the tropics here. Down in the tropics here. Tropical low depression, Gabrielle movement, 9 miles per hour, 305 degrees, wind speed 30 gusts and 40 miles per hour, pressure 1,010 millibars. Invest 99 L movement, 5 miles per hour, 290 degrees, wind speed 35 miles per hour, wind gusts not available. And travel storm, Lorena movement, 11 miles per hour, 325 degrees, wind speed 40 gusts and 50 miles per hour, pressure 1,003 millibars. And we This is being a frost of Marjorie Lee tonight for Northwest Massachusetts and Southwest New Hampshire as a frost advisory issued when minimum temperatures will drop between 33 to 36 degrees. Combined with light winds would allow for frost to form during the growing season as recommendations. Those with agriculture interests are advised to protect tender vegetation in the advisory. Any potted plants normally left outdoors should be covered or brought inside away from the clothes. And we're expecting the 40s much of eastern Massachusetts by tonight.
And Western Massachusetts could see 40s at elbow. A few parts of New Hampshire could see in the 30s, 39 in Concord, 34 in Keene, 35 in Brown Lumber, and 37 in Greenfield. A 40s stretch from Southern Maine down to Southern New Hampshire, most all of Eastern Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut could see 40s. Alright, 780 forecast goes like this. Tonight, most of the coast got lower about 40 to 45 degrees. North wind about 5 to 7 miles per hour, becoming calm in the evening. Friday, sunny skies high near 71 degrees. North wind about 3 to 5 miles per hour. Friday night, most of the coast got lower than 46 degrees. Light southwest wind. Saturday, sunny skies high near 79 degrees. Light southwest wind increasing to 5 to 10 miles per hour in the morning. Saturday night, a slight chance of showers to 2 a.m. Most of the coast got lower than 56 degrees. Southwest wind about 7 miles per hour. Transportation 20%. Sunday, a slight chance of showers after 1 p.m. Parks the Science Guys Hiner, 79 degrees. Chance of precipitation, 20%. Sunday night, most of the coast guys alone, 48 degrees. Monday, Science Guys Hiner, 71 degrees. Monday night, most of the coast guys alone, 51 degrees. Tuesday, most of the Science Guys Hiner, 76 degrees. Tuesday night, Parks the Science Guys 59 degrees. Wednesday, most of the Science Guys Hiner, 81 degrees. Wednesday night, Parks the Science Guys alone, 63 degrees. And for Thursday, a chance of showers and thunderstorms, Parks the Science Guys Hiner, 82 degrees. Chance of precipitation, 30%. Peters, what a phrase of the day! Of the evening, a chilly night on tap for the night. This is PJ Williams. Hope you have a good day with a good positive attitude. And a good evening.